Hello, I'm Henry Gao. I work for Kiapai in charge for Kiapai Manopole Group. And Kiapai is uh, established from the 1986, uh, already 24 years. And it's a long history. We grow with the IT industry. When Kiapai established, we only have the five founder. Uh, but now we have the more than 6,000 employee in the world, so it's very big jump for Kiapai. Especially for Manabo industry, Kiapai joined Manabo industry more than 20 years. And this 20 years is a big change for Kiapai. We started Manabo business from the 1,000 piece a month, but now it's a million piece a month. So it's a big jump again. But I think the, for Kia Bai, Malabo, very important is the past 20 years, we really become the leader in Malabo industry. Uh, especially the, the past four years, we focus in the Malabo, the high quality, high spec, and high performance. So the result, is that Kiapai become the number one in lead multiple innovation, number one in USB 3, and also number one in the unlock power. So everything for Kiapai, we believe we really contribute uh, a lot to the multiple industry and for the end user a lot. Kiapai multiple monthly Production is around uh, two million. Is uh, in the peak a year, and uh, in the season low, we probably produce the 1.5 million. Yeah. So ev overall, to say the yearly volumes will be more than 20 million a, a year. It's a very good number, and because we believe the channel DIY multiple 10 is around uh, 65 million a year. So Kia by power is around 30% share in the world. We have no intention uh, to occupy the very big share, but we have strong intention to lead the market, lead the, the industry, to create the value to the customer. So I think this is our direction. Yeah. For 2009, I think the most important thing is for Kia by we overcome the worldwide economic recession. We continue to grow. And we prove, even in, during the recession year, the customer they still will focus and select the quality and reliable monopoly. And second one, in 2009, we continue to generate new technology innovation to the market. So for 2009, there will be the two ounce corporate PCP. Yeah. We did uh, our multiple continually have the ultra durable, yeah. ultra durable, ultra cool, uh, ultra performance to the market. And again, we did in the market industry, the Gearbyte spec become the benchmark. Yeah. And everybody, everybody follow. I think for Gearbyte is very proud to say that. And USB 3, how important? If you take a look at the Intel or AMD, the next two years, their chipset, their spec also involve the USB 3. Then you will know this must be the right thing. Otherwise, they will not put in the, the low map. So as uh, Gearbyte, we always believe we are the leader in multiple innovation. We lead in the multiple industry. So we must invest early than anybody else. We also can lead in all the people, join us, follow us, together to create this market, together to create a value to the customer, let the customer to enjoy. Yeah. Uh, actually, the Gearbyte rely on the power use and overclocker help us a lot. And even during our development stage in each of the new multiple, we involve a lot of the overclocker and the power user to help us to, cre uh, to create their idea 
and give us their input and also their experience. And the reason why Gigabyte rely on the, those professional people to join, help us, because we believe after the, the, the professor, the user, help us the, to design a, a ball, and we can make sure our model ball, the reliability, the overclocking capability, it means the margin will be very stable. So it means the stability also much better. So they, they also can show Gearbyte in the past several years why Gearbyte's multiple quality is so good. Because the, we really get a, a lot of help from the professional. Yeah. I think uh, everyone in the future, they will need the performance data except the data. The reason is the <laughs> when I go to Nike, I go with my business card, and I, I, I leave it there somewhere, and people just find it. <laughs> Connecting to the internet will be, become a, a trend. Once the handheld device the booming, and I think the people will reduce the let up demand. But when people are using the more handheld device, you will more rely on the performance desktop on your desk, no matter in at your office or at home. The reason is, I believe that most of people would like to storage their personal data in their own desktop. And also, the desktop connect to the, the LAN, internet, you can easy to remote control, wake up, it through the outside. Yeah. But you are not easy to let your laptop always power on. So it's very important for the desktop, the future. That's why I believe in the next three, five years, you will see a, more and more people would like to enjoy their performance desktop because the with their handheld device, they really need a performance test. Yeah. I'm very happy Gear by the in overclocking the position to become the number one. Because we we had a we do you the website more and more people are using the gear by board to submit the overclocking record. And the ratio actually is more than fifty percent. Yeah. We observed, especially using the new platform. So we prove and people love gear by and this is the reason why Gearbyte focus in the overclocking uh, so much. We believe the uh, overclocking is also help Gearbyte to prove our product itself, the reliability and stability. Yeah. I'm very happy Gearbyte the, in overclocking the position to become the number one because we we had a we do the website. More and more people are using the Gearbyte board to submit the overclocking record and. The ratio actually is more than 50%. Yeah, we observed, especially using the new platform. So we prove, and people love Gearby. And this is the reason why Gearby focus in the overclocking so much. We believe the overclocking is also help Gearby to prove our product itself, the reliability and stability. Yeah. I think it's very important. So I also hope the overclocking TV website, you can more success and also deliver more knowledge to the market and let the people can enjoy. Because the, I travel to so many countries in the world, I can, I can see there are many, many countries that are booming for overclocking, especially in the emerging market. No matter in PRC, Latin American, uh, Actually, people love it. And we can see that more and more people, they're eager to know how to do it. Yeah. Please uh, continue to deliver the knowledge and the message and more information to the worldwide end user. Yeah. Very important.